Hey guys, this is Tech Racer, and today we are going to unbox the new Eyeball Slide i701 Windows tablet. So as you can see, I have purchased it from Flipkart.com, and this is the packing packaging that I received. So let's go and open the seal and see what do we get inside. So this is the box. Inside this, we have our tablet. So let's uh, quickly open the seal. I purchased the tablet for uh, rupees three thousand seven hundred, uh, and this was a discount on this tablet. That's why I purchased it. Uh, and uh, it's a very good tablet for the price that you are paying because <laughs> you can't expect the tablet at this price point. So as you can see, this is the tablet uh, that we have. So uh, as promised, we have we do have a freebie with it. As you can see, this is the HDMI cable that we get free with this tablet. So as you can see, high speed HDMI 1.4 mini cable. So that's great thing that we have it. So let's first open and see how the cable looks like. So this is the HDMI cable. As you can see, mini HDMI, uh, mini HDMI, mini HDMI to uh, standard HDMI. As you can see. So that's a nice thing that we get uh, HDMI cable with it. Uh, and here is our tab tablet box itself, as you can see. So as you can see, uh, i seven zero one performance tablet. We have a free bundle worth rupees one thousand nine hundred uh, one hundred ninety nine. Uh, three colorful covers. Uh, yes, uh, those will be inside. So let's cut open the seal and see how actually it is. So now first of all we are greeted with the tablet itself as you can see so this is the tablet that we have and we have a very good uh, Asla eyeball uh, branded pouch here as you can see so let's keep it this aside for time being and see what do we get for the inside so after that we get uh, OTG cable as you can see so this is the OTG cable for connecting your USB devices to the tablet that's good then we have a standard micro usb to full size usb charging as well as the data syncing cable that's good then we have a power brick for charging the device as, as you can see so it's 5 volt at uh, 1.5 amps so let's see how fast the charger uh, the tablet will get charged this is the user guide for the tablet you can see and some standard documentations uh, such as thank you guy uh, thank you statement then we do have a cloth for cleaning the screen and we do have a feedback form as you can see so this is it from the box we also have some stickers as you can see eyeball stickers so no, no use <laughs> and last we have all the three covers that were stated on the box so these are the covers that we get three different colors cover as you can see so let's take a look at the tablet itself and keep these things aside so this is the tablet as you can see let's take it out from the pouch okay so this is the tablet you can see a nicely branded one uh, intel inside here and uh, at the top of the tablet we have a uh, HDMI port uh, for connecting it to your TV or tele or monitor then we have micro USB port for charging we also have a 3.5 mm uh, jack for connecting any audio device at the back we have a 2 megapixel camera as you can see then here is the main speaker that we have at this side we have only a microphone and at the right side we have uh, two buttons as you can see this is the power button and these are the uh, volume rockers nothing else and at the left side we have a micro sd card slot as you can see so let's power on the device and see what do we get okay so as you can see eyeball slide coming up 
basically this is a full fledged windows uh, desktop like experience you are going to get on this tablet so let's see if we get a windows 8.1 or a windows 10 but on the box we are getting a picture of windows 8.1 so i don't think we will get a windows 10 on, on it let's see what we get So guys, I will be back once the tablet has been booted. Okay, so as you can see, region and language. So now we have booted, I think so. So we choose our country. So let me just uh, uh, set it up and I will be back. Okay, so I have got as you can see uh, upgrade to Windows 10. So I will do it later. So as you can see, uh, we need at least 3 GB and plus space for upgrading Windows 10. So I will do it later. Okay. Okay, so we are booted as you can see desktop. We have full fledged desktop here. Recycle bin here, battery 78% as you can see, and uh, let's go to Internet Explorer and see. Um, okay, so this is the window here. Okay, so it's working pretty fine as you can see. So for this, okay, okay, I will upgrade it later. Words. So again, we are back. So let's check uh, how much uh, see, uh, user space we do we get. So we get 5.55 GB of space available on the first boot. So that's good. As you can see, this is the window multitasking mode. So this is 5.5 GB available on the space. That's great. Uh, we have everything working like a desktop, as you can see. Everything here is like a desktop, so that's really great, I must say. And we do have a camera here. Let's camera your location. Okay, allow. So the camera is very bad, as you can see. It's very bad. So I don't think the picture will come out great. Anyways, I will. Uh, I will test it uh, more and I will let you guys know how does it performs uh, at the end of the day so that's really very good uh, I must say so here are all the apps that you have so so guys this is it for this video guys if you found this video helpful do hit that like button as well as the subscribe button and stay tuned for more and many more videos on this device is going to come so stay tuned for those also Thank you guys, thanks for watching.